but I bought so much stuff from Space NK. <laughs> Good morning everyone, today is Wednesday the 21st of December. I'm carrying on my like organisation thing since yesterday, I don't know what it's gotten into me. But I'm now kind of sorting through all of my hard drives and clearing them out and making sure I've got like up to date backups of all my computers. So I'm just kind of doing that before I can start editing the vlogmas from yesterday. I haven't had my advent calendar yet today. Okay. 21, God we're running out, getting close to Christmas day. presents are looking good. I want to take an Instagram photo today, but there's like no natural light. Literally, it's so dark today. So I'm hoping some good photo editing will come in handy. Oh my God, I'm just sorting through all my videos and I found this. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome back to Daily Mix. I'm Anna from Video and Doctor Maker. And I'm Lily Pebbles. And as you guys- Oh, Daily Mix days. Love to visit is Covent Garden. Look at the organisation going on here. I have split this up by year, 2014, 2015, 2016, and then I've got like vlogs, main videos, I've even renamed my videos so I can see what they're all about. Vlogmas 2015. I am loving this organisation, although I don't know where day one to five is. <laughs> it's making me realise how many vlogs I do. I think I actually do more vlogs than I do main videos. It's crazy how much I've like documented my life on YouTube. It's absolutely crazy how old some of these videos are and I remember them like it was last week. Like spring style guide, the beauty scenario tag. These are all like 2014 videos. I have so many videos to go through now, but I'm kind of just trying to collect them all in folders and I'm finding this very satisfying. So I've now labeled all my hard drives. So I've got this one, which is for computer backups for my desktop and my laptop. This one has got uh, videos from 2014, both the final, uh, both like main videos and vlogs and then 2015. Um, it's got my wedding photos and wedding videos and my Lightroom backups, which is my photos. And I've also got the wedding and Lightroom on this one. This is the one I travel with though, so I don't want to rely too much on this in case I lose it. Um, this has my YouTube music on and like most recent videos from 2016, but I've also backed up 2016 videos on here. While the footage is all moving from one hard drive to the other, I am going to make myself some avocado on a bagel. I don't think the whole of today's vlog I'll be looking like this, but I'm just trying to get stuff done this morning and then I'm gonna get dressed and head to Space NK to get something. But I need to eat because I can. I feel like I'm flagging. I love these like giant green avocados. I find them so much softer and like sweeter. I always do this to get the pip out. Kind of stab it and then twist it. And then to get the avocado out, I just use a spoon. If it's soft enough, it's pretty easy. Just kind of go around the edges and scoop it all out. And then I just use the back of a fork to kind of smush it all up. Okay, then I like to add some salt, a little bit of pepper, and sometimes I put chili in, but I'm not going to today. Just toasted a bagel. I've actually got so much avocado. And there you have my avocado on toast and a bit on the kitchen table too. I literally keep forgetting to vlog and yes, I'm still in my pajamas, but I've just been taking an Instagram photo because I really want to share uh, my Christmas wrapping this year. So I've just arranged like four presents here um, and I was just taking some photos. I think I'm going to attempt this one and see if with some editing, because you can see like these areas are really yellow. Maybe I'll show you how I'm gonna edit this. Okay, so this is the photo I'm going to attempt to edit, I think. This is always the hard bit for me, picking picking which photo I want. Do you know what? I think I want that one, so I always like to favorite the photo. Then I'm going to go to VSCO and import that photo. So. Go to favorites and it's there. Then I'm going to add the F2 filter. Put it around there. And then I'm going to save that to my camera roll. Then I like to go to Lightroom. I'm gonna turn up the exposure a bit and the contrast. 
I kind of just play around until I'm also going to turn the temperature down and I'm going to turn the saturation down as well. I'm going to save that to my camera roll and then I think I'm going to just because the lighting is so bad in here I'm going to use Facetune to just whiten the background. I don't use Facetune for anything else. I hate it when people say like come on admit it we all use Facetune to edit our selfies. No I don't. I never ever edit my face on anything. So I'm going to get the whiten tool and I'm just going to go over the table. This part's really fiddly um, and it normally takes a little while. So I'm basically just using my finger to whiten the table. I'm going to do this and come back to you guys. So that's what the photo looks like now that I've whitened the table and I really like it actually. Sometimes I use details to just go over parts of the photo like I can do the candy cane but I don't always think it needs it. I might do it this one actually. I think if you overdo it, it just looks too fake. And yeah, there you have it. I'm done. Save to camera roll. I also use an app called Mosaico, so I can kind of plan where my photos go. So if I just add in the photo here, I can then move it to there, and I can kind of see what it will look like, because that's the last photo I posted. Um, you can also write the caption, um, and when you're ready to post, you just kind of press that and it copies it to Instagram. So if you're too busy to write a caption, you can kind of pre-write it and then post it when you're ready. It is time to edit yesterday's Vlogmas. It's two o'clock. Gosh, okay, I'm going to give myself like an hour max to do this. I've spent the last few hours editing yesterday's Vlogmas, um, doing lots of work and sorting out my hard drives and all of that. So there hasn't really been anything to vlog. Rich is out at his Christmas party all evening, so I'm just like home alone. I do need to go to Space NK and I need to go to a supermarket. I obviously need to get out of my pajamas to do that. I really can't be bothered to put on makeup though. I think I'm just gonna not. Anywhere else I wouldn't care, but Space NK is one of those places that I know without sounding big headed. I think the one that I go to, one of the girls who works there watches my videos. Although if she watches my videos, then she sees me like this anyway. I'm just gonna go out with no makeup on. I'll put on a hat, that'll help the situation. I wanna go buy ingredients so I can make chicken soup for dinner because it's so cozy and it makes me feel good. My sister's not feeling well and she said she was making some for herself and it made me wanna make some too. So I can show you guys how I do that. I think I've probably shown it in a video before but I'll show you again. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, five seconds ago, this yellow other, which I know that everyone suffers from, this was completely full. My whole computer was full. So I couldn't export my Vlogmas video, I couldn't edit. And I will show you guys what I did. In the top right corner, I searched disk utility, clicked on that. And then I pressed first aid. It kind of runs a first aid on your computer. I then restarted my computer and look, I mean, I still have a lot of other, but oh my God, it's halved the amount. Thank God for that. Okay, this is gonna have to do. Um, also, I feel like this jumper is just the perfect thing to wear in this situation because it's like, no explanation needed really. I'm gonna put on my really warm boots because I'm feeling chilly. Okay, so this is what I'm dealing with right now. Every year, me and my friends, there's like six of us, you know them, Gemma, Ben, SJ, Rob, me and Rich, we get together for a little kind of Christmas dinner and we do Secret Santa. And we normally go to the pub, it's really cozy and cute. And the budget is normally 20 pounds, which I think is quite hard because it's more, it's too much that you can't just get something silly. And it's not quite enough to get something like great. So you end up in this weird like middle ground. I'm never sure what to get. And this year I had to buy for Rob. And I'm pretty sure I bought for Rob last year and I can't remember for the life of me what I got him. So I really hope I didn't get him the same thing again. But it's, it's so hard. It's hard to buy for a guy as well. And you just don't know whether to do something serious or not serious or uh, so hard. I actually spoke to SJ, his wife, and she said that he would like some slippers. So I got him some slippers. I got him these ones from Muji and I think they're really nice and they're really soft. I think he's gonna think they're such a lame present, but actually these weren't, this didn't even take up the full budget. Um, so I also wanted to get him something from Space NK because he works out a lot and I think something post-workout for like the bath or the shower 
could be really nice and they, he probably wouldn't buy for himself but that he'd actually quite enjoy but i get like present paranoia like he's just gonna be like this is really lame i really hope he likes it i'm gonna go to space nk now and see what i can get and then i'm also gonna go to waitrose and get all the ingredients i need for chicken soup it'll be good to get some fresh air i haven't been out there flat all day now i'm ready to go get some shopping and then come back home and get back into my pajamas. I've been and done my shopping, but it just wasn't like vloggable. There was so many people around and I wasn't feeling it. Um, so I'll show you what I got when I get home. But I love how this is the only time of year where I feel like it's acceptable to buy sausage rolls from the supermarket and eat them all the way home in the car. I've had three. I would never do that any other time of the year. I spent a lot of money in Space NK, so I'll show you what I got and then we can make some chicken soup. This has turned into my regular spot where I sit and show you guys stuff, but I bought so much stuff from Space NK. So I'll show you what I got. So for Rob, because by the time this video goes up, we'll be doing our Secret Santa thing anyway. I think I'm gonna wrap it up like a post gym kit. So the slippers and it's all wrapped up now, but I bought him the Aromatherapy Associates bath oil and it's the Revive one. So it's really like, it kind of refreshes you. I don't know, he probably won't appreciate it because guys just don't, well, that's generalizing. Most guys will not understand how incredible an Aromatherapy Associates bath oil is. But hopefully SJ will say to Rob, that's a really nice bath oil. Because I really did think about this present. He's going to think it's so lame. Such present paranoia. I also got another Aesop um, Resurrection hand wash because we ran out yesterday. We bought this when we first moved in. So a year and a half ago. I'm not even joking. We use it every day. It's lasted so long. Wait, that doesn't even make sense. I must have bought another one. Maybe we've gone through two. I don't know, but we just keep rebuying it because it's the best hand wash ever. I don't think this is the one with exfoliating beads in. One of them has exfoliating beads in. I bought this for myself. <laughs> it's the Mio Liquid Yoga. And now that I'm working out once a week, let's see how long that lasts. This is like for kind of post-workout. It's got Epsom salts in it. Um, it's got all these like Arnica. It's got all these great things in it that are just meant to help your muscles and dissolve away stressy aches and weary woes. Warning, may cause relaxation and happiness. It's a really nice brand. And I think Anna's recommended this to me before. There's something in here for my family secret Santa because even though I've already spent over the budget, I just saw this and thought that they would really like it. And I just think if you're gonna get one present, I really want it to be really good for that person. So I just bought something to add extra. So I can't show you that in case anyone from my family is watching. And then I also got another Space NK Shimmering Spice Candle. I really didn't need this, especially as I've just shown you guys I got a huge dip tea candle, but I finished this one last week and it's their Christmas candle. So it's kind of like limited edition and it's so good. I'm gonna light it right now. It's literally, I think like up there with my like top five candles. That's now lit for the evening. So that was my haul. Okay, I am ready to make chicken soup. And if you want the actual like, instructions, it's all on my blog. I've got it there, even though I know how to make it. Um, so I've got an onion. I've got some celery and carrots, parsnip. I would normally have swede and tomato, but I couldn't find them because I went to quite a small supermarket. I've also got um, chicken thighs. So I'm going to put the chicken thighs in. I've got this big pot my big chicken soup pot. I'm gonna put the chicken thighs in and cold water and I'm gonna bring it to the boil until all the yucky stuff comes on top. Whilst I'm just bringing the chicken to the boil, I'm gonna cut up all the veg. Onion, I peel, but I leave it whole. Oh my God, I never have this hard of a time peeling an onion. What's going on? This onion's just trying to embarrass me on camera. I'm gonna chop up the celery. I'm gonna peel the carrots and the parsnip before chopping them up as well. And then the same with the parsnip. Okay, all the veg is prepped. I mean, I'm massively missing some ingredients here, but oh well. With the veg, I'm gonna be adding two chicken stock cubes. These are Telma. These are the ones that my family use. Now I'm gonna add all the veg into here with the two stock cubes. I'm gonna put the lid on and just let that kind of cook for a while. I've made some macaroni pasta. The, pa the soup's looking, looking good actually. It definitely could do with longer. I think it tastes best when you just cook it like all day 
Um, but I'm quite hungry now because it's like quarter to eight, so I think I'm just gonna have some. Lady and the Tramp is on TV, and I've got some yummy chicken soup. What a good night in while Rich is out getting drunk at his Christmas party. I'm watching The Grinch, and I'm gonna start editing today's Vlogmas. The Grinch is finished. I've had two bowls of chicken soup, and I'm now gonna watch Grey's Anatomy. I'm such a massive Grey's Anatomy fan. I don't know if any of you guys watch it, but... It's so good, like crap good. I've watched it for years. Oh, I need some human interaction. The only person I've spoken to today is the girl at Space NK. I'm gonna end the vlog here because I'm just watching films. Rich isn't back yet. Um, and I want to edit and export this video. I'm going to the gym in the morning and I'm not sure what else. <laughs> Days are getting slow. It is the lead up to Christmas after all. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Mm -hmm.